Good afternoon, Barstow. I hope you all enjoy the two days, the two snow days and three day weekend. Amelia, what did you do during your time off? You know, I just kind of chilled out, caught up on some sleep, hung out with some friends, did a lot of homework. What about you? Yeah, I mostly just did homework for my mom's class because that's how I love enjoying my weekends. But it looks like we have a jam packed show today, so let's roll the intro. To start off today's show, we want to give a big congratulations to the five senior volleyball players who were named the Academic All-Star Team for the Missouri High School Volleyball Coaches Association. Congrats, girls. In more news, last Saturday was Winter Sports Senior Night. The girls had a great match against Pembroke Hill, winning 61-56. The boys fell a little short with a 49-55 score. Congrats to everyone competing, and a special thanks to all our seniors who have been great mentors and role models to all of us. We can't wait to see what you accomplish next year. Last night, the, the girls basketball team beat Summit Christian 44-33 in the first round of the district tournament. They'll move on to play University Academy tomorrow in the district semifinals. Amelia, have you noticed how similar some of the alumni pictures look to current students? You know, it's actually crazy you say that, because as I was walking down the hallways today, I saw somebody who looked exactly like you. Wow, I've never even noticed that. But uh, actually, Amara made a piece about current Barca students to try and find their alumni lookalikes. Let's check it out. <laughs> Hi, I'm Haley Greenwood. I'm a sophomore and I'm going to be looking for my alumni lookalike. Let's do this. We just need to find a basic blonde. Okay, so I decided to look in the colored pictures because I'm bad at like seeing what things actually look like in black and white. I thought that they were all in color. Why are they black and white? I don't, I'm forgetting what I look like, Amara. What do I look like? This is genuinely so hard. I feel like I also do bad with the people with like 90s or 80s or 60s hair because like their face looks different. And now I would have trouble like finding someone who looks like me if they have like super short hair, like super big poopy hair, you know? <laughs> Apparently that's me. Yeah. Solomon said that one, but I'm not. Not at all. Yes. No, yes. I said the other one. Oh. No, the other yes. one. Hey, this one I Hi, I'm Solomon Holmes, and I'm going to find my alumni look-alike. Solomon's look-alike. Yeah, yo, what? No, 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 not even close. Wait, okay, we found Solomon. Solomon, found Solomon look at that. Guys, that's not that even does kind of pan his face. No, no, no. 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 Yeah. <laughs> nah, bro, this is me. Easily me right here. Good-looking dude, blonde, easily me. My man, <laughs> my man Eric and me, yeah. What's up, Eric? Class of 88. This one looks like you. Come here. Right there. I know you can't tell because the hair is like... It's not me. I would never have long hair, okay? I'm not a David Goulden. Okay, so I found my uh, my lookalike. This one is so... Oh. Okay, Wow, that guy looked exactly like Solomon. Make sure to head over to our Instagram story and vote for who you think looks more like their alumni look like. Speaking of which, if you haven't already, be sure to follow us on all of our social media accounts. We're on TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Do you know, Amelia, it's crazy to see what all the alumni have accomplished after graduation from Barstow. You know, I agree. I wonder what Barstow looks like from an outside perspective. Well, funny you say that because Isabella's stepsister recently went through a tour of Barstow for the first time. Let's check it out. Yo, what's up Barstow? I'm here today at my stepsister's school, who's a freshman and I'm a freshman, and she's here today to take me on a tour of the school. Okay. Um, it's kind of boring. 
It's a little plain. We have that same thing in our school. Okay, I was just wondering if you had any like random facts about the school. It was somewhere in the ceiling. Mm-hmm. In the I think it's the junior hallway. Stuck in the ceiling somewhere. Are the two white Chuck Taylor Converse All Star shoes that have been there since probably nineteen ninety two. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. That's a random fact. Mm-hmm. Very random. Yeah, thank you. My pleasure. It's <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I liked his outfit. He looked like Justin Bieber. Looked like Justin Bieber? Yeah, with like the like the flannel, like the okay. zip up. That was your first impression of uh, Mr. Pepin? Mm -hmm. Justin Bieber? Yeah, Justin Bieber. Okay. I finally had the Justin Bieber haircut. Oh, can I interview you? Sure. Okay, what's your name? Aiden. Okay. Oh, uh, what's your favorite thing about going to Barstow? Um, probably all the opportunities that I have. Um, just in middle school, at a lot of other schools, you wouldn't be able to do like basketball or soccer, especially at my age. So that's that's one thing that I'm really thankful for. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. What's your name? Dan McNichol. Okay. What's your favorite thing about teaching at Barstow? Well, I don't teach here anymore. Actually, I never did teach here. But my favorite part about being at Barstow is I would say all of the students that we have here from grades, you know, preschool through grades 12, you can see students of all ages throughout the day. Okay. Um, who's your least favorite student? <laughs> I mean, I guess Issa Welty. Yeah. If there was going to be one. I agree. <laughs> can we interview you? Can I interview you? Okay, what's your name? My name is Penelope. Okay. Um, <laughs> what's your favorite thing about going to Barstow? I really just like everything. I like that we have great education here and it allows everyone. Okay. Okay, what's your name? My name is Lucas. Okay, Lucas. Um, what's your favorite song? My favorite song? Let me think, let me think. Go off the grid by Kanye West. Okay, okay. Okay, what's your name? Solomon Holmes. Okay. Um, what's a conspiracy theory you believe in? Dude. Uh, probably pigeons aren't real. Okay, yeah, like their cameras? Yeah, I've never yeah. seen a baby pigeon, so. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Wait, what's your name? Alex. Okay, what's a conspiracy theory you believe in? Uh, Elvis is still alive. Okay, I believe Michael Jackson is still alive. No, Elvis is. Not Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson is still alive. Your school looks haunted. <laughs> like, I would be scared to, like, be here. Why? Because it's, like, it's old and scary. Okay, guys, I think I got to know Barca pretty well. Um, I'm literally Barstow now. Um, okay, I learned that there's a pair of Converse in the ceiling. It's pretty cool. Um, and the food is a lot better than public school, so. Thanks, Isabella. I had no clue there was a pair of Chuck Taylors in the ceiling this whole time. Yeah, it's also super strange that uh, Mr. Pepin's store remembers that. Yeah. Well, Amelia, it looks like that's all we have for today. I'm David. And I'm Amelia. Have a great day, Barstow.